what is up everybody welcome back to the channel and welcome to freaking happy hour this might be something that i start who knows but um i always like to keep it real man i like to i like to always just uh, just keep it authentic and 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 document all i'm doing man is documenting so if you're new to the channel my name is david i'm out here in san diego building a social media agency and a digital publishing company just taking my knowledge and 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 monetizing it right turning it and turning it into a coaching program or some type of online membership course where you can where you can package up your knowledge and literally help people and these people will pay for it absolutely insane that's where we're at today 2021 and beyond we are in the knowledge society people are are, are creating content bringing value and 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 that's worth money right people you know are able to build following that's what influencers are all about that's what these channels and 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 huge youtube influencers are all about is just building a simple following in a specific niche like super super powerful so if you're into that type of stuff man i've been doing it since 2016 um focused around social media marketing facebook advertising for small businesses small businesses specifically real estate agents and, and just keeping it simple, man, keeping it simple. I truly believe in the basics, dude. So stuff I do over here on this channel is very basic. It's for the beginner. Um, um, and, 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 and it's all about starting off your online business on a strong foundation. That's what it's all about. I, that's why I truly believe in the basics, right? The basic fundamentals will build, you know, leaders and, and huge, huge businesses and freaking and, and brands. So I truly believe that. So all I'm going to show you in this case, you guys, again, day in the life, bringing on a new client. I'm going to do some simple Facebook coaching with her. Um, I'm going to simply help her optimize and customize her, her Facebook business page and, and really take this following to a whole nother level, take her content to a whole nother level. But, 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 but again, as I always talk about on this channel, it's all about that local business owner. So if you're that local business owner building something in your backyard, you have to be over here on Facebook. You have to be running targeted ads. That's what it's all about, man. That's why I, I preach daily over here is, is the local business owner, the local targeting and, and, and putting some type of offer in front of your local community to get them to raise their hand, click into their name and email and, and download something of value that you could be giving away to your audience for free right? In return to catch, capture some data and, and obviously be able to provide value and monetize on the back end, right? Powerful, man. So in this case, Shay, all I'm going to do, the, the, the biggest thing about running ads for other businesses and even knowing how to do it for yourself, you're a small business owner, you're looking to really get into Facebook advertising, Instagram advertising. What do you do? I teach a lot about that on this channel. So subscribe, smash the bell for notifications. Don't miss a freaking video. But in this case, whether it's it's your business or whether you're servicing other businesses like I do, I do both, right? I, I, I run ads for my own shit, and then I'm also servicing clients. Um, and after starting with 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 real estate agents um, in 2016, and that's what I you know still service till this day, um, I realized that it's the same shit for everyone, man. That's why on this channel, I try to keep it general. That's why on this channel, I don't really necessarily try to zoom all into real estate agents because the, the what I've been teaching them since 2016, social media marketing, Facebook advertising, capturing leads, email automation, it's the same shit for every business, small, medium, whatever, like um, basic, basic stuff, man, running ads, landing page, email automation, right? So some of my clients, are learning all that. That's what I do now is I, I literally focus on teaching people how to do it themselves. And then, and then, and then I have some clients that are so freaking busy where they just rather have you do it for them, you know? So, so whatever floats your boat, these are packages that you can, you can, you can, you can, you can offer other businesses. But again, if you're that business owner, you're that real estate agent and you're watching the vid this video right now or whatever, let, let's say you are the business owner. You need to know this stuff for your, for your business especially if you're super busy and you plan on delegating this to somebody else. So you got to know both ends, man. You got to know both ends. If you're a small business owner, don't think you could just delegate right away and not know anything about Facebook advertising or, or how to capture a lead on online or, or how to, how to put leads into an email automation and, and, and drip on them. Right. This is basic online marketing that most businesses don't do, man. That's what I'm saying. If you're servicing other clients, there's a lot of potential. I'm over here servicing Shay. Shout out to Shay, you know, crushing it in Colorado. Now she wants to crush it in Colorado, but on social media, um, but not necessarily just social media, Facebook advertising, 
right? Very specific, targeting her local backyard, giving away some type of free download, some type of PDF, some type of seller guide, some type of buyer guide, some type of coupon, whatever, apply it to your business. What can we give away of value for free on the click of a freaking click? And that person gets there, enters, enters their name and email and downloads your free offer. It could be a coupon, it could be a discount code. It could be a free PDF. Seven tips on how to raise the value of your home before selling. Seven tips to, 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 to avoid when trying to increase your credit score. Seven tips to, to, to implement to build more muscle and lose more belly fat than you ever have in your life. Um, five ways to increase your FICO score by 300 points. Click here to download your free copy. Right. So whatever your business applies to or, or yeah, applies to whatever it, it whatever business you're building, dude, it's the same shit for everyone. You have a major opportunity with Facebook ads. So in this case, I'm helping Shay. I'm going to be coaching her. I'm going to be getting, getting access to her business page and I'm going to simply walk you through how I do it. Very, very simple. Right. Um, so, again, whether you're, you're watching this video and, and, and you're servicing other clients just like I am. Right. I'm servicing Shay going to be doing some Facebook ads for her. Um, and so I got to request access to the page. And that's all I'm going to do right now is request access to her page. Once we really start doing hardcore advertising, which, which that's not even my model today, I teach people how to do it themselves. So I'm going to be rocking with Shay to teach her how to do it, do it herself. Um, I, don't, I don't do ads for people anymore. That's not part of my, my business plan. I want to coach them and teach them how to do it themselves. And then my, di my digital publishing side of, of everything I'm building is taking all that knowledge, packaging it all up in a digital course and selling that. Right. So that's scale. That's freaking, you know, when we just go from zero to hero in, in freaking in no time. Right. Um, real quick. So, again, whether this is your business or you're servicing others, you still the same same strategy applies. OK, so so here's what I'm doing. All I'm going to come over here to do, come over here to, to, to her business page to do is I'm going to come over here to click and copy this. So I'm copying her um, um, business page link, and then I'm going to come over here to my business settings. This is where you want to be, okay? So come into your business manager, come into your ads manager, click on these dots. Wherever you see these freaking dots, click on those dots, and all you're going to do is come to business settings, okay? You're going to come to business settings. And then from here, I'm going to pages. And you'll have a few different accounts. So click this drop down, Inspire Digital. Hit that drop down, and maybe you have other accounts. Find out the account that's the business manager. You want to be rolling and rocking out of the business manager, not the ads manager, not your account, right? It's it's the business manager. Okay, so it should be separate. It should be a different one. This is my business manager, Inspire Digital. So in here, I have a bunch of different you know clients that I that I that I work with. So. Um, Here's all you do, man. Here's all you do. And again, whether you're servicing a client or whether you're the client, and now you have to get, give access to an agency. Now you have to give access to your Facebook advertiser. Now you have to give Facebook to your freaking David, right? So this applies to you too. So this is how you're going to do it. Um, in this case, again, I'm servicing her. I copied her business page link. I'm going to come over here to pages. I'm going to hit add request access to a page and I'm going to paste in her link right there. Okay. Now I already have access to her page. So um, in fact, I can even show you an example of anything, right? Really actually to tell you the truth, look, and then I'll just remove it right away. Here's what you do. Here's, here's exactly what you do. So let's say, let's say, um, let's just go to, let's see if she has her business page listed. Um, Rowena. Um, okay. So um, actually that's a freaking group. Damn it. Shout out to Rowena. That's my Karcher group. Let me see. Okay, this page right here, Fly Homes. Okay, so look, I'll go to the I'll go to Fly Homes, right? The business page. I copy this link. I want all of it. Give me the whole HTTPS. Give me everything, right? So I'm going to copy that, and then I'm going to come over here to my business settings, pages, add request access. Find that drop down. You want to make sure you always find that drop down, and then manage page request access. So look, here's what's going to happen. Bam. They just got a notification. They're like, holy shit. Who the hell's Dave inspired digital? What? Someone's trying to hack me. So I got them all tripping out. Shout out to freaking fly homes. But it's all good. I'm going to remove myself right now. Anyways, I'm just showing, you know, my YouTube fam over here, how it's done. That is what happens. Request access to fly homes, right? I hit close. Now it's pending. Here's all I tell the client. Here's all I tell the client. I say, I say, Mr. or Mrs., you know, freaking Shay Holmes, here's what I need you to do. From a computer, and this is what I'm telling my client. I'm saying from a computer, come to your business page. And on the left-hand side, I'm literally sending this to them in a Facebook Messenger voice. 
under 60 seconds, I'm sending, I'm sending them this message. In fact, in fact, I'll, I, I don't play with you guys. Look, shout out to Shay. This is the, um, just respond to requests, go through a few of those, um, confirmations, enter your password and that's it. Then I can set the ad, uh, the like ad live, and then I'll email you a snapshot of the actual ad once it's live in the newsfeed. Okay. So we're Shout out, shout out to Shay. So this is what I tell them to do, you guys. This is what I tell them to do. I tell them to come to their business page, right? It's going to look like this when they're doing it from a computer. They're going, to, they're going to have admin access. It looks like this. Come to the bottom left, bottom, bottom left. Click on settings. And then you're going to click on page roles. All you're going to do is scroll down to the middle of the page and you're going to see inspired digital. Over here to the right, it's going to say respond to request. Respond to request, enter your password. And boom, I have grant, you just granted me access. Now here's what's going to happen. I'm going to get an email just like this. You can now work on a new page on Business Manager, which it's, it's Shea Sells Colorado. So it's this page right here. She just granted me access. I got this email right away. And here's what I, here's all I do. I click on the blue button and it's going to bring me back over here to the business settings, right? It's going to come over here. It's going to, I'm going to, I'm going to come over here. I'm going to go to pages. I'm going to go find her page, right? All I'm going to do is go find her page. It's right there. I'm going to go find her page. And then what I absolutely have to do is I have to click on add people. And then I click on my circle, check my circle right there, come all the way down. I want manage. That's what I requested. I requested manage all, like give me full admin access. And I, and I do that. In this case, I'm only running it. I'm running it from my ad account, but from her business page. I'm running a simple like ad for her on, on, on in this case, right? Once I start coaching her and once I start teaching her how to run ads herself, I just simply show her how to do it through her ad account. So, so those of you, man, again, I have a free cheat sheet in the description, fbadscheatsheet.com. Download that freaking cheat sheet. It goes over all this stuff. Actually, it goes over custom audiences, custom conversions, and, and what you need to set up first um, before any of this stuff, right? But, but download that, man, and stay in touch because this is the type of stuff I'm dropping. Here's what's going on. I want, once I coach her and, and show her how to do these ads herself, she'll be doing this from her, her account. So that's why I don't need access to her ad account. Um, all I'm doing is I'm running it from my ad account, but from her business page. So I'm, I'm just simply requesting access to the business page to run an ad, but I still request full admin. Okay. And then, so that would allow me to come down here to full control, manage page. And I want this one. This is the only one I need to click blue. Okay. So click assign and that's it done. Now, as I come over here to the dots, and I click on ads manager. As I go through and set up that ad, um, I'll see the drop down to choose her business page and, it, and, and that ad is ran through through them. So now if she goes to her page, in fact, let me go to, um, let me go to the fly homes real quick. So look, here's back to the fly homes. Look, I click on that and all I gotta do, these people don't even know me, they're tripping out right now, right? They're like, holy shit, who's this inspired digital freaking request and access, right? They're all tripping out right now. But all I gotta do is hit cancel request. So cancel request and boom, I'm out of their out of their radar, right? So if I refresh this, I shouldn't see that anymore. Let's um, give it a little freshy real quick. Okay. It's gone, it's gone, okay? So once you get that email, you guys, Click the blue button, um, add your name to the page, and that is it, man. That is it. So that's how you request access to a Facebook business page, um, or that's gonna how that's gonna be how you give access to to a person. You're gonna come in, come to your business page, click on settings, click on. Um, let's go back to the business page, to the very very left, to the very very bottom. You're gonna click on settings. You're gonna click on page roles. And then if this is um, a job that, an, that a marketer is doing for you, your Facebook advertiser, your, your agency, they're, they're running the stuff for you. Okay, cool. So this applies to you in this way where it's like, okay, you do this now. And now you're going to see their name right there. And all you're going to do is respond to request. Okay. Respond to request, put that password in and, um, and that, that business owner or that, that, you know, agency or fa Facebook advertiser or whoever the hell you want to call them. They'll now have access just like I now have access to. So now if I come back to the business settings, if I refresh this page, this is what I'll see. So um, right here, if I come down to the page now, so look, now it'll say permissions given. 
manage page, publish content, um, moderate ma- messages. So I get it all right. It was the full blame, the full blown freaking enchilada. It was a, it was a whole damn freaking um, 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 admin access, right? So boom, got it all. Just need to add my name. And that's it, man. So that's how you request access to a business page, you guys, or give someone access um, to your business page in 2021 and beyond. I'll see you in the next video. Over now.